What's going on everyone? Hello there. My name is Mitchell Coleman and I am an alcoholic and I have your daily reflections for September 24th, 2021. And this comes from the daily reflections book, uh, book of reflections for by AA members for AA members. And today's title is vigilance. And also this month is suicide awareness month. So if you know anyone that has went through this the situation of suicide or lost someone to it or just, you know, someone struggling, um, reach out to them. Pretty important stuff. Okay. So vigilance. We have seen the truth demonstrated again and again. Once an alcoholic, always an alcoholic. Commencing to drink after a period of sobriety, we are in a short time as bad as ever. If we are planning to stop drinking, there must be no reservation of any kind, nor any lurking notion that someday we will be immune to alcohol. And that is very, very <laughs> important because as someone that's relapsed many a times, you can hear certain things like, um, you know, I bet my tolerance will go back down and um, it won't take as much and it's just not true. Like once I relapsed, I was right back where I was before, but this time it's worse because you already know you've quit. So now you're already depressed anyway. Well, for me, I'm already depressed anyway. Then I relapse. So I already have that seed planted and I'm drinking again. So I already know it's wrong and I'm already messing up. And, and the more you do it, so then again, I have another period of sobriety, go back. Each time it got worse to the point where um, I can't ever go back, especially like See, I have this tattoo here and it's like, I'm sitting at a bar with that there to remind me. And um, yeah, it doesn't, it doesn't get any better. Um, today I am an alcoholic, tomorrow will be no different. My alcoholism lives within me now and forever. I must never forget what I am. Alcohol will surely kill me if I fail to recognize and acknowledge my disease on a daily basis. I am not playing a game in which a loss is a temporary setback I am dealing with my disease for which there is no cure, only daily acceptance and vigilance. And what is vigilance, you ask? Let's go ahead and ask someone about it. Alexa, give me the definition of vigilance. Vigilance is usually defined as state or quality of being vigilant, watchfulness. For more, ask me to give you more definitions for vigilance. Alexa, That'll be enough. That would be enough by Philippa Sue and Lynn Manuel Alexa, Miranda. Just stop talking, please. Well, wasn't that nice of her? Okay, so I'm not playing a game in which a loss is a temporary setback, and I'm not because, like I said, when I go back out, it's it's worse, and um, I'm gonna die if I do it. It just is what it is. There, It is what it is, and I'm not going to be able to mess around with that again. And I just talked to someone the other day, and they're like, are you sure you're not even going to be able to have one drink? And I'm like, no, I can't. I can't have one drink. Because some people do enjoy the taste of alcohol and certain drinks and whatnot, but I never really did. I was just doing it to get drunk. So one drink for me is pointless because there is something in me that just wants more and more and more. And... Um, even though I'm healed and working on healing in many other areas of my life, I will never even use that as an excuse of like, well, I know now that I was dealing with trauma and this kind of stuff, because even though I figured out that stuff, I'm still an alcoholic, you know, and um, that's okay. It's just like when people say they, next time I'll order an Uber, next time I'll do that, we think we figured out ways to beat it. And just the truth is we haven't, and it's okay. It doesn't make you a bad person and it doesn't make you like, I am an alcoholic and I will be forever. It's like, whoop de doo I'm an alcoholic. Just like some people are diabetic, just like some people can't eat sugar, I can't drink alcohol. So it's nothing wrong with that. And um, yeah, that's what I got. And I hope you guys got something good from that. And um, again, Suicide Awareness Month, um, there's charities you could donate to and um, people you could reach out to. and. I wish you all the best. Love you guys. Remember, one day at a time, you got this. If you need any help, reach out. Um, please subscribe to my channel and share it. Like the video. Share it with anyone that you think it may help. It does help me. It helps my recovery. And it helps me um, being able to share with other people. Because 
this is uh, very important for me. I don't get to as many meetings as I'd like, so believe it or not, this is like um, a good meeting for me, if you will. So again, I would appreciate it if you'd uh, just press the like button and share the video, subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys. Have a good one.